What's up my people? Bless up on yourself. Welcome back to the channel. Leave a like and also subscribe to the channel. Click the tap bell icon to get notified whenever there's anything new on the channel. So the first thing I'm going to share with you people is a police where them say they'd kill him girlfriend. Right? Police constable Linval Eard who was convicted in July 2017 of the murder of his 17 year old girlfriend Shana K. Clark was today freed by the court of appeal. The Crown had alleged at the trial that Clark was shot in the chest and abdomen from point blank range after she and Eard were seen sitting in Eard's car. The incident took place in Savannah Lamar, Westmoreland on the night of April 2010. Eard had denied killing Clark and reported that someone else had done the shooting but he was convicted by a jury in the Westmoreland Circuit Court. He was sentenced to life imprisonment and ordered to serve 20 years imprisonment before he could be eligible for parole. A man was arrested and charged with Clark's murder but the case against him was discontinued after the director of public prosecution ruled that Eard should be charged. Eard who was formally attached to the Westmoreland Criminal Investigation Branch, filed several ground of appeal challenging his conviction. Attorney at law, a. Reed, argued today that the conviction was unreasonable based on the evidence. The court upheld Reed's legal arguments and freed Eard. So people, you know, see a police said to me one time, say, you know what's the innocent man that prison? And from that, me look into it. And say, a real thing in my talk. Disprove it. You see me? I say, but not because you get a not guilty verdict. That means say you not do it. It just means say them cannot prove say you do it. You understand me? So still we don't know who do the killing. But them said the female was shot from point blank range. And people see the police, the ex police, and the girl in the vehicle. You understand? So, how somebody else come do the killing and the police not get hurt? That more often. You know. So, as me say, people, you know what I mean? Innocent man that are prison and not because. Your, your, them say not guilty means say you not do the crime so I want to tell me what I think in the comments right so we are going to move on my people to over in a Kingston right we are shooting Guan and a man get charged for it so them say a man has been slapped with several charges for allegedly shooting another man and maiden lane in Kingston and August. So oh this are from Ag yeah from August, right? Charge is Delray Basco, otherwise called Bangers of Gold Street in Kingston. He has been charged with wounding with intent, possession of a prohibited weapon, and possession of ammunition. Reports from the central police are that about 6 10 a.m. A man was walking along the roadway when he was allegedly pounced upon by Basco and another man who opened gunfire hitting him. The complainant was taken to hospital where he was admitted in serious condition. Basco was subsequently arrested and charged after a question and answer session in the presence of his attorney. A court date for him is being finalize so guys let me know what you think in the comment section so we are going to move on my people to a man where the police them want you know them say so them call him devil man you see me police seeking devil man for allegedly killing ex's lover so me i go put up in picture right here so i'm also i go put it um upon the thumbnail right the St. Catherine police have issued a wanted person notice for Peter Davis, known by his alias as Devils, or Devilman, 
who is alleged to have killed the current partner of his children's mother. So I'm getting more than one picnic with this woman. The police say Davis is unemployed and his last known addresses are Penn District in Riversdale and West Prospect in Bagwag, St. Catherine. It is reported that about 7.35 a.m. on Sunday, Davis went to the home of his baby mother. So, them say she a 40, right? She's a caregiver and the mother of his children, right? Baby mother, mother of children, all right? In Penn District, Davis is accused of fatally shooting Richard Swaby, also known as Richie R. Billy, a carpenter, and Barrett's current partner. Oh, so the man is a carpenter and him are the female current partner. Yes, what I say? Following the shooting, Davis reportedly fled the scene on foot. The police are urging the public to be on the lookout for Davis and report any um, sightings or information immediately. They say Davis is considered to be dangerous and the public is advised against approaching him. Instead, they are requested to contact the police emergency, you know, Crime Stop or the nearest police station. So this money of people wanna get him in quick. You know what I mean? Because more than like for you know why would I possess a man figure can up the man we are deal with him woman currently. I'm ex him get couple of youth out of the woman, me no know how much, more than two or two. See? And him choose figure kill a man over him woman. You see me I say, me no like them type of man there. You see me I say, the reason why you and your woman left, I don't know. But obviously, she no want in a nothing with you because she find her next man. And this man go kill the man with the woman I deal with. John Star, RIP to that man and condolences to his family. I hope them find a brother here quick and fast and get him behind bars because I just saw him belong. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section. So the next thing, my people, Opel, Opel Ibersa gone down at school gate, Georgia. The Bursa, the Opel High School in Hanover, was shot and killed outside the institution this afternoon. He has been identified as Mr. Roberts. He was reportedly attacked by a lone gunman as he was leaving the school compound approximately 4 o'clock. Jan was star. So people that saw them share, as soon as there's more, I'm going to give you guys an update. Jaja. R.I.P. to this man, you know what I mean, and condolences to his family. This is sad, is it? So, subscribe and like me, people, and thanks for watching.